Hi, my name is Arnie Bevins. I'm the Assistant Director and Plant Superintendent with the Town of Vernon Water Pollution Control Facility located in Vernon, Connecticut. This is the fifth iteration of a plant on the same site. There's been a plant located on this site since 1898. The river that goes through the old Rockville section of town wraps about 300 feet and two and a half miles, uh, resulting in a lot of free energy for a lot of industrial applications. So early, early on, Vernon they had the need for wastewater treatment to protect the Hockenham River, which is what we discharged to. The Vernon facility today serves five communities, uh, far less industrial than it did uh, 30 or 40 years ago. The resulting flow today is predominantly uh, sanitary sewage, residential, uh, with still a small industrial contribution from dye houses. The Vernon facility uses a Siemens Zimpro packed process for its treatment to remove the dye component of the industrial waste contribution. Just a note of interest, Vernon was the first full-scale uh, packed process literally on the planet Earth. Uh, we've been running it since uh, 1978 and there are now only 12 of this type operating in the United States. We upgraded the plant in the early 90s and decided to stay with the same process. Uh, the result was a much smaller construction footprint no secondary solids disposal issues because we do on-site regeneration of our carbon and the resulting water to the Hockenham River is about as good as it gets uh, of real significance because we are 85 percent of the Hockenham River from our discharge point on downstream. Uh, as a matter of fact, downstream of the river on the Hockenham we support a wild trout management area which is something you wouldn't have seen in the river 25-30 years ago. Uh, we have fairly stringent effluent limits here in Vernon our permit is uh, 2020 for BOD and TSS, and we typically average in the single digits. Uh, we have seen turbidities as low as a half a unit leaving the plant. Uh, the plant functions very, very well. The treatment plant today is designed for an average daily flow of 7.1 million gallons per day, with a daily average of plus or minus 4 million gallons. The eight operators, three supervisors, our collection system supervisor and collection system operator, and our two very capable people in the lab are the reason that we were recognized by the New England Water Environment Association for the Wastewater Utility of the Year Award this year.